What's going on everybody? Hotfire MTG. This is Tage, aka Matt, aka Tage. Call me whatever the hell you want. We are back and I am doubling up today. I've been meaning to do this video for a while. Honestly, I've been sitting on both these products for like two to three weeks and we're gonna open both of them. So here we go. Let's get into this. Uh, I think we'll do the Chandra Spellbook first. I thought, why the hell not do both of these products in one video because um, they're they're both relatively quick openings. So I thought ah, I should have uh, should have been more careful opening that. That's all right. I don't need to keep the box. I don't really care. So they're both relatively quick openings. So I thought, you know what? Let's double up. Let's do the Chandra Signature Spellbook and Mr. T in one video and see if we can pull some hot fire. So I've opened one of every, this glue, I don't wanna bend the cards here, but we've got this glue holding the booster pack down. Try and get that off. Wow, that is really, that is really stuck on there. Okay, um, I've opened one of every signature spell book uh, that's been released so far. Uh, and this is the only one I'm gonna do of the Chandra spell book. Um, I think, personally, I think this is probably the best uh, spell book they've done yet, personally. Um, oh, wow, you look at that. You guys see that line down the middle of the card? Like that roller mark? Look at that. It is a perfectly straight line, straight up, top to bottom. I wonder if the, the rest of the cards... No, I don't... I see a little bit of a dent at the bottom of that one. Nothing on that one. Yeah, look at that. That first card, that is the first thing I noticed. You guys see that roller mark, top to bottom? Try and get it on camera there. That is crap. I hope that is not one of the best cards in the set. That better not be the uh, the Torch of Defiance, man. I'm going to be kind of pissed about that. Anyways, let's see what we got. I really hope we hit that foil, Torch of Defiance, man. So, we got the Young Pyromancer. Ah, our Young Pyromancer. Uh, that was the foil right on top. I didn't even realize. The Young Pyromancer is the foil. Ah, uh, kind of lame. Okay, well, that's that. basically you know everything that's in this pack then. There's a regular Young Pyromancer. We got the Rite of Flame. Pyromaster Ascension, we got the Pyroblast, Past in Flames, Fiery Confluence, it is, the the friggin' Roller Mark card is gonna be, of course, Chandra, Torch of Defiance, absolutely gorgeous card, but look at that, flippin' Roller Mark right on the back of it, that is brutal, anyways, I'm not gonna worry about that right now, that kinda sucks, um, talk about quality control. Hey, that's something, nothing new, nothing new, Wizards of the Coast, I don't think is a stranger to complaints about quality control, but anyways, I'm not going to dwell on that right now. Let's get into this Core 21 pre-release pack. Um, I am going to play against Beach with whatever I get from this. So there's our promo, we're going to leave that to the end. Um, so we are going to play, um, a, probably maybe a best of five just to, so we get a whole bunch of games out of it. And I am looking forward to it. We've played in arena, but I have not played core 21 in paper yet. So six packs, let's flip and do this. Um, you guys watched, we did a box opening video when it came out on release day a couple weeks ago. Um, that was a spicy box. Did you guys see that? Um, Oh, is this like backwards? We got token in the front? Okay, backwards packs. I, and I think we got a pretty spicy um, mythic right off the start. We got Mangara the Diplomat. Yeah, holy smokes. So this is a backwards pack. We had token and the land first. And then there is our first mythic, not a rare, Mangara. Wow, huge hit. Furious Rise, Seasoned Halloblade, and Kinetic Augur are the uncommons. Let's just make sure the rest of this pack is is legit yeah so just backwards that's super weird i know i've seen that there's other packs um like i think modern horizons had a bunch of packs that were like backwards you could either get the rare mythic and foil first or you could get it last but i've not really seen that i don't recall seeing that with um with standard booster boxes is this the same yeah this one's the same so we got the token and the land right there, and a Temple of My Lady. By the way, I, I do love those lands. Those foil ones that come in the uh, in the collector boosters, man, they are flipping gorgeous. I really like them. Temple of My Lady, though, that, that kind of sucks. Swing and a miss, and we got the Obsessive Stitcher, Selfless Savior, and a Tolarian Kraken. So like I said, guys, I am going to be building a deck, but I'm not really going to separate all the colors right now and, and go through that whole process right now. We're just going to crack it, 
see what we get see if we pull anything spicy and uh that mangara uh that's a spicy start so yeah it looks like all these packs are backwards so we got an angel token got the tranquil cove and hey conspicuous snoop um you know what drives me nuts how everybody says conspicuous snoop it is it, i am really really certain it is not conspicuous it's conspicuous but anyways i digress i digress i don't really care doesn't bother me doesn't bother me it does bother me it really flipping bothers me <laughs> okay um this is pack four this is uh yeah no this is pack three right yes we got two packs left after this am i am i got do i have that right yeah i think i got that right anyways there's token planes or er, planes forest hey we got a foil palladium mirror that's kind of cool foil uncommon not bad and liliana's standard bearer uh it's got flash uh when it enters battlefield it draws x cards or x is the number of creatures that died under your control this turn so card draw in black a little um a little more un uncommon than card draw obviously in blue but so that's pretty sweet that's not actually a terrible card um i think that'd be fun to play in limited so we will obviously see if we can make that happen all right two backs left two backs left we burned through four already uh one mythic not too shabby. Think we can get another mythic? Think we can find something spicy? Ah, uh, Goblin Wizard. That's kind of... I, I like that Goblin Wizard token. I like the art. Ah, uh, Thornwood Falls and, hey, Tolarian Archmage. We got the Professor. There he is. There he is. Um, yeah, when, when you use when Battlefield, return for one target creature, Planeswalker, to its owner's hand. Uh, at the beginning of your end step, if a permanent was put into your hand from the battlefield this turn draw card so i don't know about limited um seems more of a, a constructed kind of card but who knows i don't know that we'll really i yeah i don't see myself playing that in limited but we'll see all right last pack last pack and again we got the rare or mythic right up front maybe we'll have a foil huh. hey containment priest that's pretty sweet um hell yeah i do not have a copy of those a copy of one of these so hell yeah i'll add that to my collection um again in um in limited not so sure but that's a sweet card that i'm happy to add to my collection so yeah not like the conspicuous snoop is pretty good and the mangara is obviously pretty flipping sweet i really don't know um like no real no real bombs uh, as far as limited play go. Like Containment Priest, the Tolarian Archmage, the Standard Bearer. Standard Bearer maybe is the best rare or mythic for, for limited play. I really don't know. Um, I don't know if I'd really consider any of those like limited bombs. But last but not least, hopefully this is a limited bomb because I am going to need some luck against Mr. Beach. What do we got? Ah, transmogrify um so three and a red exile target creature that creature's controller reveals cards from the top of their library until they reveal creature card that player puts that card onto the battlefield shuffles the rest of their library so you know what i probably will actually play the i mean if i end up playing red that is not bad four you can exile like one of your one of your one drop creatures and hopefully dig up something a little better um not really any value there but not terrible could be worse all right hot fire mtg guys before i go somebody nab this code uh good for six core 2021 booster packs or one if you've already redeemed before so if you've already redeemed before maybe leave it for someone who hasn't be a nice be a nice person do the right thing hot fire mtg guys this has been Tage, aka matt aka Tage, for hot fire mtg I uh, hope you guys liked it. Comment, hit subscribe. Later.